a card which just takes your breath away. Uh, this is one of these offerings that is altogether too rare in the world, but uh, worth celebrating when it does surface. This is indeed the, the highly coveted uh, championship ticket parallel of that contender's Tom Brady rookie. Um, it is it is the modern trading card. If, if there was to be a comparison, the only comp that we could think of might be an RPA LeBron rookie from 03 Exquisite. Um, but on price point to price point, this is probably the most expensive modern day trading card in the world. If you want the best of the best, it's the equivalent of the Honus Wagner T206. Um, similar quantities exist. Uh, I would argue that the popularity of Tom Brady far exceeds Honus Wagner, and that's nothing against Honus. Uh, but the reasons the prices have you know, really soared is just that um, there just aren't enough of them to go around, and this is the highly coveted you know, uh, focal point that any ultra-high-end investor would focus upon. This is the trading card. Just a gorgeous parallel designated by this extra foil region on the, the right edge, but obviously what sets it off is that serial number. Only 100 made, this is serial 25 of 100. Uh, it's just hard to put into perspective the extreme scarcity relative to demand. The subs as they break down, the surfaces received an eight, it's the lowest, everything else was a eight five or better. There's a microscopic couple points of um, chipping on the surface there in the, in the foil and that's you know a common flaw for this contender's foil region. That's probably why the surface received an eight. Everything else about the card is very, very well preserved. I mean, incredibly well conditioned corners. This edge, tiny little chip there. These corners are about as sharp, they're virtually mint condition on the corner side. And those are the two things that your eye catches the most. This top edge, very important to the eye appeal, is very well preserved. Just on down the far right edge, the bottom edge. Again, just beautifully preserved card. They just didn't make very many of them, but those that do exist, very few can compete with this one. Just light bits of wear to the periphery. So again, from a you know positioning perspective, uh, this is one of these cards that just transcends trading card investment. This is a tangible asset. It's a portfolio diversification. Uh, if you're gonna own any trading cards, uh, this is on the ultra short list, perhaps the single most important trading card in the world.